Hi everyone, this is Rana and welcome to a new Light Up Card tutorial. If you watched my tutorials before, you will notice that I always like to create an interactive Light Up Card, but for today's card, I chose to create a very simple circuit. And as always, I first designed the circuit template and the battery holder template in the Silhouette software, then sent the battery holder template to the Silhouette portrait machine for the cut and I just printed the circuit template. You will find all the links where you can download all the templates in the description below. Okay, now I'm just creating these holes on the circuit template so they can guide me where the lights will go exactly on the background. Now it's time to create the battery holder and as you can see here I cut the battery holder template three times and I am sticking the three layers together using the liquid adhesive to create a thick board which have the same thickness of my battery. What I'm trying to do here is to create a small opening on the card base so it will make it easier for us to pull out the battery holder and insert the battery later. Now I am just attaching the battery holder thick board that we created on the card base using double sided adhesive. And in the same way, we need also to attach the circuit template using double-sided adhesive above of the battery holder template. Now let's complete building the movable part of the battery holder. I also cut it three times and I am stacking all the layers together using liquid adhesive. Now let's check it and actually it works perfectly. Time to build our circuit and I am using for that Chibitronics copper tape and three red LED stickers. I need to figure out now where the lights will go exactly on the fireplace. So what I am just doing is putting the fireplace above the background, making a simple marks, then creating the hole for the lights.
now it's time to add some colors and ink the background and i am using for that gather twinks and ground espresso distress oxide inks To add more contrast on the background, I sprayed it with the water and splattered it with brown watercolor using a small paintbrush. Let's start the stamping process and the stamp set that I am using for today's card is Warm Greeting Stamp Set by Magingo Designs and I am embossing the sentiment It's the most wonderful time of the year using first time mark ink and white embossing powder on the background. After finishing building our circuit and inking the background, it's time to attach the background above of the circuit using double-sided adhesive. Off the camera, I stamped a few stamps from the Warm Greetings stamp set by Magingo Designs using Memento Tuxedo Black ink and colored them using Arteza pencil colors, then cut them out using a pair of scissors. And this was my card for today. I hope you like it. You will find all the links for the templates and the products in the description box below. Thank you so much for watching and have a wonderful day. Bye!